Happy Holidays! I'm back. Today is... Yeah, we have a lot to catch up on. So, um, I'm a dad, okay, as of October 17th. Um, on the 20, well, hold on, let's, let's do this the proper way. Today is the 25th of November 2018. I know it's been a little while since I spoke to you guys. I can explain. So, as of uh, the 17th of October, I became a father. And, um, um, my child doesn't sleep at night. You know, very odd hours of rest. <clears throat> and so, I don't, um, I don't know, man. Like, they tell you that your kid doesn't sleep, babies don't sleep, you kind of think you're ready for it. I wasn't ready for it. I've been meaning to get in front of this camera for a long time. And, excuse me, update you guys. But I just couldn't do it. I just didn't have the time. So today I'm taking the time. All right. Um, on the 26th of... What was it? 26th of October, like a week after my son was born, I had a full cornea transplant. I can't see anything right now. It's still very blurry. It feels like something's in my eye all day because there's stitches that uh, won't come out for a year. But, oh man, I was dang near, what, a month ago? So, doctor see my eye and they say I'm doing good, healing up nicely. So, uh, kind of at the end of the road with the eye thing because, I mean, they've kind of done everything that they can in terms of procedures. Um, the reason why I had to have a full cornea transplant is because after they installed the new lens, you guys remember back in 2016, Um, I developed a tumor that they had to get rid of and that procedure, it just damaged my cornea, you know, I never really recovered from that. And so my cornea was pretty much so scarred up from that, like not even from like getting stabbed in the eye, just from, you know, the, the, uh, substance that they put in your eye. It's like an alcohol, like they put it in your eye, they fill up the tumor with that, and then they take it out, and they fill it up again, and they drain it out. Like that process pretty much did a number on my cornea. And I never really, you know, recovered from that. I had all these other procedures, my pressure had gone up, I had to get laser surgery for my pressure. Um, today my pressure is stable right so that's good but um you know i had to have a few other procedures because of that so now that that's being addressed and you know changed i guess that's the best that doctors can do at this point so we're just hoping that things get better from here you know so all right guys that's all let me um get back to the kid and we'll talk more later